start off with the cream base, and this is from the Maybelline Eye Studio Trio in Blue Freeze. And I'm um, just going to be using this gray base right here. And it's a really creamy um, shadow, but then it turns kind of powdery on your eye. So I really like that about it, but it still acts as a cream base. So I'm just going to apply this all over the lid and a little bit up into the crease. And then also on my lower lash line. After that, I'm going to start off by using a cream eyeshadow, a cream eyeliner, sorry. This is from e.l.f. And I'm just going to be using a eyeliner brush that I don't really use. And this one is also from e.l.f. And these brushes are only a dollar, I think. And the cream shadow is only three dollars. So I'm going to pick up kind of a lot on my brush. And I'm just going to do like a really thick um, line, um, eyeliner line that covers up my entire lid. So... You guys see? And this dries really fast, so you kind of want to do this fast. And then I'm going to take a kind of thick eyeshadow brush, like this, and I'm just going to take that. Um, cream shadow and I'm just going to bring it all the way up and just blend it as much as possible. And then you'll see that this will start making it kind of a gradient effect from a dark black to kind of a gray. the same thing on my lower lash line and I want to concentrate it on the outer corner on my lower lash line if you guys can see that Okay, after that I'm going to go ahead and apply my highlight and I'm just going to be using this color from Mary Kay and it's just a white color called White Sand and an uh, eye defining brush and I'm just going to sweep this under my eyebrow. Next I'm going to take this really dark purple color which could um, sometimes pass as a black and this is from the L'Oreal Quad in, this is from the L'Oreal Studio Secrets Quad in Lavender Smokes. And it just looks like this. And I'm going to be using this very dark purple color. And I'm going to just take my, um, take my e.l.f. eyeshadow brush and just pick up a lot of this color and just pack it over that um, cream shadow, that cream liner, and concentrate this on the outer corner, but you're going to take it all over the lid, and a little bit into the crease, and I'm patting this to, um, to really bring on the color and to avoid any fallout. I'm going to take a really thin eyeshadow brush like this one and I'm going to pick up some black and this is from the CoverGirl Quad in, in, in Drama Eyes and I'm just going to pick up this black color and um, put this on my outer corner and start bringing it into my crease. Can you stop the back to go? Go ahead. I'm going to be in the background. And you just really want to define your outer corner. Um, color that's kind of my skin complexion, and I'm going to be using this one right here. And I'm going to pick it up on a pencil brush. 
So I'm just taking this color under my eye and bring it all the way up. Blending brush and blend this color out that I just applied. And then on my blending brush, I'm going to pick up some of that purple that I used on top of the cream liner. And I'm just going to blend out my entire lid. And this purple has shimmer in it, so it's going to kind of add a little bit more shimmer to our look. And it's going to help um, decrease all the harsh lines. Then I'm going to apply a kind of thick eyeliner line, and I'm going to be using my Ultra Liner um, Waterproof from Maybelline, and this is just some black. Okay, I went ahead and applied a coat of Lash Bash Fusion from CoverGirl and a coat of um, Victoria's Secret Beauty Rush Mascara, and those are both just some black. And the next thing I'm going to do is apply false lashes, and this is the false lashes that I'm using, and these are just from Walmart. Um, they're 33 black, I don't know, they're kind of dramatic false lashes. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this.